knowing the universal signs for getting help if you are abducted or in distress. Let's listen to this law enforcement officer tell how they were alerted and saved a young woman's life. This, then you tuck your thumb in and all four fingers over that thumb and back and forth. A motorist uh, notified our 911 dispatch center that he had observed a young lady uh, in a passenger car that she appeared to be in distress and that she was giving the TikTok signal to him that she was in distress and had a fear for her life. We positioned ourselves along the interstate at exit 41, about nine miles from that location. And our detectives even said that they looked in and the female was still giving that signal, which we didn't even know what it meant. Uh, we do now. And uh, we conducted a traffic stop by boxing the vehicle in. I got the 16 year old missing person uh, female out of the vehicle safely and arrested the, the driver, a 61 year old male from the same town that this young lady was from. Had there not been someone out there that knew how to interpret what she was doing, uh, then uh, who knows, we may not have had a good resolution on this. And maybe this will be a good thing because uh, this is a national, this story has went national. And uh, we think that uh, motorists and law enforcement agencies nationwide should be aware of this and know what this signal means. And I think it can be quite useful in the future. This is a call to action for everyone who is at risk of abuse or in fear for their life. Set up a safe word with family and friends, a word that can be unusual for you to use and say to that person so that they are alerted that something is not right. Then they can call the police for a welfare check on you. Danger can come unexpectedly. Know these signs for help. Put your hand up. Close your fingers so that your thumb is under your fingers. SOS is similar. With all your fingers and thumb spread open, bend your thumb inwards towards your palm and your hand. Then close your fingers over your thumb and repeat. A victim can do this to make it look like they are stretching from stress. And a perpetrator may not notice. So if you notice someone doing this, notify law enforcement. Take a video or photo if you can. This will help to capture something that could help the police. Contact Legal Minded Friends if you are in an abusive relationship. We can discuss the options that are open for you to keep you safe.